Che here, the No Spoon Podcast. Thank you for checking out my channel. If you like what you see, go ahead and subscribe and turn on your post notifications so that you don't miss out on the latest content. Also, like and share with as many people as possible. And if you got an opinion or something that you just want to add to the conversation, I want to hear about it down in the comments section. Until then, enjoy the video. Uh, Brianna Joy Gray. There, there. I think that's what you're referring to. Yeah, yeah. Brianna Joy one. Gray is on the populist left, um, and she agreed with. So MAGA has evolved to the abolish the FBI. I think so. Marjorie Taylor Greene says abolish the FBI. Brianna Joy Gray agrees abolish the FBI, and instead of she has a platform, Marjorie Taylor Greene has a platform too. I'll hold her to the same standard. Instead of those two people getting on a a podcast they both have platforms and saying whoa we both agree let's talk about it no arguments or anything like that brianna joy gray goes on the podcast with the young turks and jank and it was basically jank and jank is just you know attacking her disrespecting her bringing up other people and i'm like there was an opportunity for us to do something if you really want to do something perfect example she could have done it after the Cenk, the, the Cenk interview and still connected, still but didn't. instead she didn't. Well, I think that's the thing is when you look at, like like you said, the populist left has always been anti-state. You know what I mean? And now just recently they've become very, very, very embedded in the state. And so that's why I always say these are like my, my thing is this. When these, these same people are saying, hey, we should defund the police. Okay. Okay, but the same people won't say when it comes to the gun control argument, well, are the cops going to get rid of their guns? These are the same people that you make arguments and you tell me all day long that they're racist and they need and they can't they need to be put in check. They need to be abolished. We need to defund them, yada, 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 all these different things. But when it comes time to gun control, nobody's saying let's let's lead by example and let's let's disarm the police. Let's disarm. Like, that's my whole thing. You first. You want us to get rid of your gun? You first. And they don't yeah. do that. And these are the po these are the populist left. These are the revolutionaries. These are supposed to be the AOCs who are supposed to anti-state. We hate these. You know what I mean? This and this and that. But yet they give more power to the state than anybody else. That's what that's what kills me. If you're really about that, then you should have not. When you hear somebody on the other side saying abolish the FBI, I'm saying yeah, me too. I, I agree with that too. Why do you agree with it? Let me tell you why I agree with it. Let's try to meet in the middle and let's try to make something like this happen and let's start a movement. But that's why I'm very much against the race stuff, because the reason why, in my opinion, Brianna Joy Gray is a black populist left. The reason why she would be very hesitant to agree with Marjorie Taylor Greene on anything is because Marjorie Taylor Greene has been labeled as this and that and this and that. So even if the populist left agrees on abolish the FBI, she's very scared and hesitant. She can go on with Jenk. He's labeled as a loud mouth, but he's not really labeled as like, like a you know right wing nut job or something like that. So then she says, well, I don't, I can't really go on with Marjorie Taylor Greene. Or she'll say, oh, I was the first. I hate hearing that. Like we we said it first. I'm glad MAGA just came around. Who cares? Are you about it or not? Exactly. You have more people. I mean, every. I mean, the whole point. Your the whole point is to get people on your side so that you can actually accomplish what you're trying to accomplish. What are you going to criticize the, the second person that joins you? If that's the case, we'd have one person movements all the time. You know what I'm saying? You think Martin Luther King was like the you know his right hand man and was like get out of here, copycat? 